Hi everyone, welcome back to another Isle 2 Great Battles video. Here we are with Trophy and Chapinski's Korea. We are now flying for the 621st Ground Attack Squadron, flying the Isle 2 Storm of it. Today we have an enemy frontline attack. The date, the 21st of September 1942. Takeoff time, 12 minutes past 8 a.m. The weather is cloudy at 1400 meters. Primary objective. Your task is to attack enemy troops and emplacements at the enemy forward line marked by point 3 on your flight map. As always, be aware of enemy fighters that may try to disrupt your attack. Armament for this attack will be to equip the two VYA-23 cannons, plus we'll have four FAB-100M bombs and eight RBS-82 rockets. Enemy fighters! Enemy fighters! Right. Let's proceed to our attack area. We're almost there. 109's all over us. Okay, friendlies on them. Go low, try and get a bit of speed, get to the target location. I don't have a mirror on this thing. And there's the uh, there's the rest of the flight over there. I took a bit more evasive action than they did, so I've dropped back a bit. Throwing this heavy aircraft around. Don't worry, she's fairly rugged. We can take the odd hit. It'll be okay. Right, we're in the target location. Just need to look for some ground targets now. Okay, I can see the targets. I think they've already made a pass. I can see something burning. We're going to come in on that smoke. Oh, yeah.
think we got something. Something's exploding now. Then we've got another bomb left. And we've also got the rockets and the cannon. So we'll come in again. For another bomb run. This time on this little bunker or dug in position. Bomb's gone. Aircraft over there. Right. Bombs used up. Now have our rockets. The little friends seem to be doing quite well keeping these uh, fighters off us. Alright. Coming around. Target these bunkers right here. I keep calling them bunkers, they're not bunkers. Gun positions. fire something going down there in flames right one thing I've learned from our quick runs there is that we really need to get the aircraft lined up we can't be crabbing in otherwise the um, the rocket fires uh, do go off at a, at a horrible angle right we're following our flight here Strafing this target. We'll come in with rockets. Right, let's get her straightened up early. Oh, it's already gone bang. Right, let's pick the further one. Try and get it straightened up. There we go, nice. Already looks destroyed, actually. Right, with the skies clear, we've uh, we've bought enough time for our friendlies to make their run. It's time to make. Oh god, the visibility in this aircraft! Uh, it's time to make our way back. Whoa, what a night! Woo. Stalling, we did, couldn't bring the nose or the guns to bear. Okay, we're just circling around home base now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no warning, we just got. Blitz by a 109. Now we start to see the anti aircraft fire in the sky. Bit late, boys. Bit late. Bit of damage, but I think we're okay. As I say, this is a flying tank, this aircraft. Sirens going off, but I can't see the aircraft. Ah. 
follow the anti-aircraft fire. That's slow moving, that's one of us. I think I should have brought a rear gunner on this one. Is he attacking one of our flight? I think he might be. I was holding on the rudder, and then he kicked on the rudder as well, and then we... It's the classic, when you're flying towards each other, playing chicken, you don't actually fly directly towards each other, you're both on the rudder. And then when you let go, it gives you the kick, and you miss. Okay, you've got a fighter on him. And here we are, mission successful, mission accomplished. After 42 minutes and 20 seconds, we were only credited with one medium armor target destroyed. Um, so lots of um, ordnance thrown out the targets. Very little actually made any difference at all. But one medium armored vehicle has been destroyed, so we'll add that to the tally. And if we look a little bit deeper into the rest of the flight's performance, we can see flight lead was able to destroy one medium target as well. Um, second, Andre was able to score three machine gun kills. Um, Mikhail sadly was killed with no credit to his name. Stanislav also killed with um, no credit to his name. Uh, Taras he was able to claim a machine gun kill and there's our medium armoured. So uh, we were probably a bit average with the rest of the flight to be fair. The loss of Mikhail and Stanislav will be uh, deeply felt within the flight for sure. Moving into the 621st HQ, you can see we now have, we, ha we did have um, a new pilot there, St Stepan. Uh, we've got Arkip, who's wounded, and we obviously Mikhail and Stanislav, who we lost this time. The squadron is quickly racking up the kills. We now have 17 vehicle kills, 9 transport, 1 light armoured, 7 medium armoured, 7 heavy weapons kills, 4 machine guns, 1 AAA, and 2 rocket launchers, and 1 building, which is a residential building, which we won't ask too many questions about. Looking at the uh, top of the pops, we are obviously top with 21 kills, having come from uh, fighter squadrons. Uh, we may stick a tail gunner on. We, uh, I think we've seen enough action to know that a tail gunner will be a useful addition, even though it will cost us with speed and weight as well. But um, it will be useful for the for our defence for sure. 
One of the questions that did keep coming up, Trophim was obviously doing a Lend-Lease aircraft career, um, but I just want to talk you through who, who we've got left now. We've got um, the 629th, which is flying the I-16. We have the 273rd, which is flying the Yak-1. The 27th, which is fl flying the LA-5. The 437, which is flying an LA-5 as well. We have the 621st, which is our flight, which is flying the IL-2. We've got the 11th, which is flying the Yak-1. Obviously, they are the 11th of the aircraft that are coming up as our um, bomber escorts, basically. The 503rd, who are flying IL-2s as well. And we've got the 811th, which are also flying IL-2s. Um, so that was the choice. And of those, I decided to choose the 621st. So we could do some ground attack. It's not proving particularly well. So we may transfer maybe to the Yak or one of the LA-5 um, squadrons to see if we can get some fighter kills as well. But we'll, we'll, we'll try and hone our ground attack skills. A lot of work to be done. So that's what we'll continue to practice. And we'll do it again next week. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. As always, hit that like. Please put your feelings in the comments section below. What would you like to see? Would you like to see us transfer back to a fighter squadron? Let me know. We can always do that. That's fine. Transfers are available it's all good uh, and always if you haven't subscribed then please hit that subscribe tickle the bell so you get the notification only 15 percent of my subscribers are getting notified of the youtube video releases so yeah hit that bell for sure to get the notifications thank you so much for watching take care i'll see you next time Bye bye